Both. Two, one. You put both live on one, which is fine. But you told I me to do it on one. But but one of them. How will you know when anyone's looking? It's so dark in here. Listen. But one of them is Mom centered. Likes it, bro. One of them is centered, which I like. Not oh. this one. See how? See how all this is centered. It's already ten likes. How do I select all so I can make everything centered? Do you think they These are all centered. This one is yeah. the next one is like justify. Mm -hmm. Bro, we're like all that. centers, but we've all been justified, it's all bro. It's all, all different. different too. It's a different size too. We're all yeah. different sizes, bro. So how do I how do I make them all the same? We don't uh, want to make this all the same, bro. Hang on, hang on. I think you just hold. What? Why? Why is there 176 viewers for yeah. this? Why are there 176 viewers for this? It's like that makes no sense. When people hear the dude dog Dizzle's got something going down, why are there 200 viewers? They can't for this? stay away. Why are there 223 viewers for this? There's going to be 223 million here in a second. How many people want to hear him ask that question five more times? <laughs> why are there 220 viewers I, on here? I, I, I think I selected people. all the rest of it. So why are there 100 people? Why are 226 this? people watching this? You think you did not? Why is there 230 people even watching this? I don't know. We were we, we did a Wait YouTube a test. Did you just you know erase it everything? It was what? my description what? of it. Did you just erase everything? Oh, Jesus there. erased my sins, no, bro. Wait, wait, I, 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 so I selected those are called Jesus jukes when you do that. So what? A Jesus juke. Where somebody like says something and you like over spiritualize it to like make them sound like they're like not as spiritual as you. Like he's like, why Jesus erase this? Like, That's hey, funny. bro, Jesus erased all our sins. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, and he's like, why is the text uh, all justified? I'm like, bro, we've all been so, justified in His blood. That's called the Jesus shoot. I had this friend, Sam, Sam Shamoon. You said uh, he would say, "Hey, loser," and I go, and someone would go, "Why do you call me a loser?" I go, "What? We we lost our weight of sins." <laughs> See, exactly. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm talking about. And his friend, his wife, always wanted to be super spiritual. Nothing could ever just be funny more, or something like that. Right. It had to have some great cosmic purpose. Jamie C. Right. Yes, it is the same. And, uh, so we were See, temporarily staying with my wife's mom, who lived on Gunsmoke Circle. She lived in this uh, oh, yeah, in like Vegas in, on horse there. property. It's over here. And so I was on a Western <laughs> kick at the time. And I would go. I was going to the video store. They're still selling videos. And I was getting. Who wants you drink, bro? But a third thing is, David is sipping his scissor phone. right now. Hang on, hang on. Listen. Anthony's finishing this oh. half-hour story. Well, why don't you get in the camera if you're going to tell the story? Shh. Yeah, he's, he's telling right up. Like, Listen, I'm trying to talk to you. He's telling the story, but they can't even hear the story. Hey, go. It's <laughs> taking me half an hour to tell the story because I, I just said it's a half-hour half story. We yeah, got a bunch of, bunch of get, get, So, give me your punchline. So listen, no, no, no. So my, <laughs> my, my mother-in-law lived on Gunsmoke Circle. That's where we lived. We were staying with her temporarily. I had a cell phone, one of those old cell phones that wasn't very loud. And the only tune that was loud enough for me to hear it was the uh, sound from the good, the bad, and the ugly. And uh, I was going to the video store. I used to have that as my. Listen, I was going to the video store to get a Western. So all this is just a coincidence on this particular occasion. There are no coincidences, right? bro. Not hey, a sovereign, bro. Hey. Listen, <laughs> so I had a friend who was coming into town. And he wanted to pick something up for me. And while I'm standing in line, this guy looks back and he's wondering why this young kid has this old Western. You know, he just kind of makes this, you know, grimace or smirk or something. So I get a phone call and it goes with the sound of the good, the bad, and the ugly. And my friend asked me, where do you live? And I told him, blah, 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 gun smoke circle. And so this guy... This guy was looking at me like I was crazy, like I had some kind of a Western kick. It's all a coincidence. And <laughs> and that was the point of the Wait, story. Wait, that was the punchline? That was funny. <laughs> you guys are all just lame. Anyway. <laughs> I can't just teach you guys what funny that was is. A long stuff. Never <laughs> allow him on a live stream <laughs> again. That's why Anthony is banned from live streaming. That's, that's <laughs> hey, how do I see what messages people are saying? Okay, let me show you. Let me show you. All right, here's what you do. You got to communicate with people, man. But bro, yeah. I've been communicating Gotta, with people. I'm saying people people want to hear what's going on. I know they do. But I'm gonna show you how to do it. You've been too busy, whatever, whatever. <laughs> you gotta type in like 900 things. No, you don't gotta type in 900 things. I should have clicked on that. <clears throat> Where's everybody from? When I'm teaching you technology, David. See where everybody's from. Let's I see. don't need the extra pressure of all this hate. Just stop hating. Start participating in all the right. comment section. All right, now look. See this? Boo this man. Look, do you understand this, you oh, old no. man? Boo this man. <laughs> Hi, gays. What are what are the most uh, Oh, you need to make moderators. Music? Whoever you trust in here, because like that dude that just said that, he <clears throat> needs to be removed. 
But like, we are not going to do this. Why? Let them make fools of themselves. So, mm -hmm. okay, here's what I'm going to do. Oh. oh, so this is too much. So I'm going to, I got to put this no. on slow mode. You're getting too many comments at once. Yeah. Oh, people are signing in from where they're from. Oh, okay. So that's fine. Let them. Do you see anyone you trust on here? You need to make moderators. That's what we need to start doing. Like, do you know, know, is there any names you recognize? You know what I'm saying? Like, we could take a chance with some people. Well, I like, mean, this this all a test. So, so just let it I go. Know, just, a bunch of people make fools out of themselves. Then, yeah. uh, I'm gonna make we'll some find, of you look, 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 moderators. No, no, don't make anyone moderators right now. It's only for oh, this. Oh my goodness! All they're doing is moderating comments. They're not doing anything I'm else. Saying, they have you, no you other could, power. You can check comments for this and make the moderators in the future. I'm not gonna do that, bro. I'm not gonna do all that. And, <laughs> and neither are you. The people who I, I trust, some of you, based upon what I know about you, I'm gonna make up you moderators. All right. I'll be careful. But all, all they do is block people or remove them. That's all it does. You know, guys don't understand. They don't. They, it's not a bunch of more. Uh, what if you enable a bunch of lunatic no. moderators and then are you can tell and then they bro, block all the cool people? Or something. Don't it's do not it, gonna bro. happen. You guys, this is your friend's the first time doing this. Why do you trust your judgment? I do trust my judgment. I don't trust you. It's your judgment. Well, then you trust. then you should do it. See, how can you not trust this person? They didn't know I was about to do this. Oh, this person said, my friend, Look, Zaka see? is hiding in Malaysia. That's a good dude right there. I, that, see, <laughs> my point is these are before I told people I was going to add moderators. No, you, yeah, you but, can trust but people them. could anticipate, hey, if I say something nice, I'll no, make me a, a moderator, and then I can block all the cool people. There's no way. Hey, DM you guys Laney. You and talk to people? Just trust me. Just talk to people. <clears throat> Oh yeah, these are good. Cause you got. How do they know I'm on here? Don't want people. It comes up in their feed or yeah, something. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. See. Yeah. So anyway, I've never uh, live streamed. We are checking it out because I'm debating Shabir. So here's what you look. In a couple weeks. Hey, hey someone said psychopath. <laughs> Mon Spaghetti said psychopath. See, so that person. You don't have to block. They go. It's, what, what? They spoke what? the truth, man. They spoke the truth. Oh, huh? <laughs> uh, they're in timeout. David the Crit. That person's in timeout now. Hey, moderators. We got a timeout. Hey, moderators. <laughs> if someone makes a comment, put them in timeout. The way you do it unless is you it, click, Unless it's a mean comment about vocab in case. Look, give them a... Click on the whatever, three... I don't know. Comment. Give them a heart. Hey, click on the three <laughs> little dots beside on the right side of their name, and you time them out or you can uh, delete their comment, okay? That's what you do. The moderate people I just made moderators, that's how you do it. Don't listen to David, all right? Don't listen... Uh, someone, uh, J G bot Winnick 49 said, I know David and vocab. Who are the other two guys? This is John McRae. And the other guy brother. who's on timeout for telling us a half hour story <laughs> is Anthony Rogers. Anthony's, uh, setting up. We're going to record, start recording some videos on the doctrine of the Trinity in the old Testament. Karazian, uh, you, you said boo us. You get timeout. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I like this. This is power right here. Yeah, this so is pure, now this is pure power. Now do you understand what I was trying to tell you? Like just chill. I think hey, oh, Carmel Clunk. So I know her from my stuff. It says slow mode is on. Yeah, it, 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 ha it means people can only send a message every 60 seconds. We oh. have so many users, viewers, you've got you to gotta do, do that. that. So I already had it set up. See? <clears throat> just let Papa take care of you, bro. <laughs> hey, Carmel Crunk, you need to be like the key moderator. Tell the other moderators how to be a moderator. Can I be Jordan Evans? Because I know you already know how to be a moderator. Do you know who Jordan Evans is? No, I, I can. You just said howdy. Oh. All right. Well, let's just let's just let's just give him a what? They only have mod controls. You're just randomly making no, people it's moderators. Not randomly, my it's not channel. randomly. Oh, this person's from Columbus. They've got to be good. Hey, what's up, Ben? Nineteen ninety nine. Hello, David. What's your live program for? It's not about Look, anything. Another person seeing, from Columbus. You're just seeing if it works. Two people from Columbus. Hey, what's up, Lake? Two people from Columbus. Look at that. <coughs> Dang, Greece. Greece. Kentucky. I used to live there. I used to live on the island of Crete. Not a teaching moment. I think they're talking. The city of Hanyak. Oh, Rocky Christian here. Oh, that's dope. Yeah. Hey, instead of just looking at comments all day. Well, get the, whoa, 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 someone's asking. Uh, whoa. Here's what a moderator is. Hey, let me tell you real quick. <clears throat> Go ahead. Here's what a moderator is. Hey, SpongeBob SquarePants, I, I notice you. Dude, what? You said notice me. Okay. I said I notice you. See, <laughs> they get it already. Look, Apologetic Avengers Assemble. See, I'm telling you, they get it. What? Here's what a moderator uh, Ohio and West Virginia, that's us. <laughs> yeah, the collaboration, right? Here's what we actually look like right now. Hey, so here's what a moderator does. You go on the right side of the person's name. There's three dots, dot, 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 that appear. You click on it. 
if the person is making a rude comment, you can delete it. You can put him in timeout. You can remove them where none of their comments show up. Just you'll see the options that are by there. You can report the person. So when someone comes on the live stream abusing it, changing the subject, posting a bunch of links, stuff like that, just get rid of them. Like so, you know what I'm saying? And they can check out the next one, I think, or maybe not. But that's what the moderators do. And so they have to. They keep the the live stream. Uh, they keep it uh, pure, so it's not just indented with uh, craziness. And uh, can you do where you got that? Uh, so this is your comments over here. Not on, uh, not on that part of it. I okay. can't. I can only do it on here. But for some reason, his are underneath instead of on the side. I don't know why. But I'm gonna let you guys. I'm gonna let you. I don't know why it doesn't uh, do it. Oh, <laughs> nice, nice, right? Where to go here? Here's what we look like right now. There. The work. Yeah, go down a little bit. Or <laughs> Thanks, bro. Appreciate Whoa. that. Yeah, you know. Let me see if there's a way to hold on. I'm gonna mess around with some on of these Amazon. Controls. See, that is just for people that have been invited. So this isn't like the live stream comments. You see what I'm saying? You have to go on YouTube to look at those. This would be like if you invited somebody else right. to come in and join us, and they would appear down here. Right, right. But we haven't done that. But there are other controllers here. You look at the side, but you don't want to end it when you're doing it. Yeah. But uh, see, like, and you can mute yourself, mute this. You see there's different things you can do. Yeah. All right, well, David, everything's so, set yeah. up, bro. Yeah, you're set, man. Um, here, if you want to, if you want to talk to people, though, you got to go out of here. Why? You because you because you can't you can't see what people are saying in here. You have to go back out into YouTube and watch okay. it with the sound off. So then you just so you look at yourself, but that's fine, right? Yeah, you can't see yourself, but it's okay, fine. Go back to where people are saying stuff. I will, but how do I help me out, John? I'm having trouble. I, I hate uh, when I get, yeah, I get like stuck in here. <laughs> See what I'm saying? How I'm just like stuck. Don't want to click that. Yeah, don't do that. There you go. Don't. Yeah, don't do that. Just uh, how do I? Why won't let me like? Oh, dude, you're a sixteen percent, bro. What? My power. Oh, right. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I got it right. Here, can you uh, can you minimize this and go back into the the video because I can't do it now. What? Minimize this. Would you? Would you do? Well, it's, it's, you know, that's what you need to see. That's what I was trying to get up. Yeah, right there. Yeah. So we'll cl now click on, oh, wait. Where's the, just go on your YouTube channel because I don't see it. You seem to go back to your own YouTube channel. That's probably over there. I don't, I remember shutting it down. Get some power. <clears throat> All right. All right. So, so let's explain to people what we're doing real quick, though. Yeah. YouTube channel because I don't see it. You always got to kill the sound on that. You know what I'm saying? And so for some reason, yo, you guys hear us? Hold on, I need to go back to where we were because this version for some reason doesn't let you see comments. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. So what were we on before? Oh, we had to go to Chrome. You're on Chrome. You're I That's think Chrome right there. Well then what what, what was it? Chrome right was, there. What no, was they, it? Look, that's Google Hangouts. All right, Live. There you go. There we go. Okay, so where? Where's Robert yeah. Spencer? Sorry, need to see. <clears throat> David wears sunglasses tonight. All right, let's tell everyone what we're doing. Uh we started last month getting together uh, about once a month to start recording videos. So we're uh, we're practicing. Um, recorded a couple of videos yesterday. We got three the day before that. Um, recorded a what did we record today? Recorded an interview. Did an interview on, on my channel. Yeah. Um, so if you guys don't know, um, uh, my channel is called What Do You Meme, and it's W H A D D O U Meme. And so um, I just recorded an hour and a half interview with David Wood, and I'll be releasing it hopefully today. Um, should be. If not, it'd be up for sure tomorrow. So, yeah, yeah, definitely check his stuff out. Yeah, his stuff man. is super dope. Hey, I just saw you guys, uh, K-Dub, K-Dub and Lita. I just saw you two. I know you guys. These are my people coming on, which is excellent. And Carmel, those are like some of the best ones. So I made them all moderators. They know how to hold it down. And then uh, K-Dub, Lita. And Carmel, you guys, you can make other people moderators, right? I think you can. If you can, let me know you can, and then I'm not going to do this anymore. I'll let you make people moderators from now on because I don't want to. I don't want to mess with it anymore. Just make people that you can tell are good. Uh, I think you can. No, no, you, I wouldn't add anybody else because then you're going to get more people that are going to say. Well, the that, thing is, when you know, you've got like 400 viewers no, or whatever, you need a decent amount. Don't worry about it. Was not worried about it. I wouldn't need it because if not, you're going to keep adding people, and people are going to say stuff. You know what I mean? To be perpetrating. Ah, it's know. good. You set the standard to let them know we ain't playing, homies. No. Yeah, I'm from Columbus too. 
This is like the third person from Columbus. I'm originally from Columbus, so that's why I'm giving shout out to the Columbus people. All right, you can look at the comments. All right, we're ready. Ready for what? Well, if we're doing his stuff or if we're doing mm -hmm. promos, what are we doing first? Uh, let's do the uh, the promo for your little. What are you doing? It's hot. Man. Yeah, it's getting hot in here. It is. Well, I'm not allowed to turn the fan in my own house. Oh, so, so, so anyway, uh, a little while back, said uh, on my channel that we were going to be preparing a kind of parody of the documentary Super Size Me, which Morgan Spurlock ate nothing but McDonald's food for 30 days to see the impact it would have on him. We're going to uh, record a uh, series of 30 days worth of videos called Islamicize Me. And um, and I said we're going to be recording a Jesus versus Muhammad epic rap battle. Um, and then a bunch of people are saying, you know, how can how can we how can we see you guys doing this and so on. And some people who are who are uh, in the area, of course, can can we need extras and stuff. So uh, if you're in the the Phoenix area, you can uh, you can you can join, especially if you have some some acting skills or cool location to record a scene. But um, a lot of people who won't be able to to be there but want to see what's going on. We figured we'd. Uh, I figured I figured out how to use live stream, and then we could just have live stream running while we're uh, recording different things, so you can see what's going on behind the scenes. Yeah. So this was a uh, practice for that, and uh, I guess we can leave it on for a while in case. Uh, no, in case anyone wants to see what we're going. No. Yeah. Um, Vocab and I are going to record a little promo for our, uh, apologetics conference here. When is that? Next week. It is the last week in oh, February. Okay. He's, he's just coming over here to do it. Here. <clears throat> here, here. <clears throat> oh, how do we get back? No, it's not. You, you, can, you, you know you can see it if you put it right in front of there. What is All this? Right. Just tell them what it is. Oh, yeah. So if you're in the Arizona area or can watch the Southwest, got a great conference on how to do evangelism and discipleship to Muslims. So this is uh, in, a, in a certain context. <laughs> you definitely want to learn how to do this. So. We got Brother Jafar, a Jordanian Christian, coming all the way from Cali. He's got some dynamic teaching. We also got uh, Brother Jeff Cran. He's a Jewish believer in the Lord. He's going to talk about Trinity Foundations in the Old Testament. We got uh, myself doing some stuff. We got Al Fadi, a former Saudi Arabian Muslim. We got a testimonial from a Muslim um, female who's uh, recently converted. She's going to share some of those struggles. We got George Saeed coming from Anaheim, California. And Ashley, they're going to teach us how to do... Um, evangelism actually at the mosque. So we're actually going to go out to some local mosques and do some witnessing as um, the folks are leaving for a Friday, June, prayer, and that's going to be real dynamic. We're going to be on the public sidewalk. We're not there to protest. We're there to give them gospels of John. You know what I'm saying? So the date is February 23rd and 24th, February 23rd, 24th here in Phoenix. It's in the downtown area. One's at first Arabic Baptist. The other one's at uh, Hillside Baptist. It's uh, Friday night, six to nine and Saturday, 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. So more information is on the Facebook site, which is uh, First Arabic Baptist on Facebook, and also on Twitter, Arabic Baptist AZ. If you have any questions, email Arabic Baptist AZ at gmail.com. If you can't remember all that, just hit me up. I'm one of the organizers of the conference, but you definitely want to go to this. So, <laughs> yes, you do need to get that book. We're doing all right. Yes, you can find that book on Amazon. Thank you. You're awesome, too. Am I going to debate? I have debated some Hebrew Israelites already. David's phone is not from the 90s. This live stream is a first for Act 17. Nigeria does need an apologetics minister. Remove the comments this time because I know I'm a writer. Oh, okay, good, good. Then I know who you are. That's excellent. Oh, my, David Wood live stream now. Yep, you got it. It's crazy. Oh, good, good, good. Oh, from Somalia. You want the book in Somalia? Just go on Amazon.com. You're going to use it to team my church. All right. Hey, K-Dub, I thought I already made you. Why'd you go off? K-Dub, I made you. Oh, you are. You just don't have the little thing beside you. Uh, good job, Mario. Who the leader? Right is right. Um, <laughs> yeah, that is right. Who are the hero? The, some of these comments are super strange. Some of you guys are just weird. <laughs> YouTube is always a friendly place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. Yes, I do too. Miss him as well. Yes, we do have the Twitter. I'm Vocab Malone, and he is John McCray. How do you Thank spell? You. That? Oh, actually, no, my Twitter. My bad. My Twitter's under. Uh, what do you mean? So, uh, yeah, if you missed it, it's uh, W H A D D O Y O U M E M E.
Yep. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the first time that he's live. Yep. It does take a village to do a live stream. New shades, Wood. New shades. Drop some flows, Wood. Yeah. Drop uh, some flows, Wood. What? Drop some flows, Wood. <laughs> hey, I could play a beat for real, actually. I could actually play a beat. <laughs> but don't we need to record? Actually, guys, we need to record. What? What? what you're always yeah, rapping. Right you're always rapping. You ain't going to rap? What? I can bust a rhyme. All you right, want well, no. to give him something while I uh, drop a beat for you? Wait, you want to play a beat? <laughs> no, I'll give you a beat while you uh, Oh, really? Right? Right? Yeah. It's going to be embarrassing, though, bro. I'm retired, bro. Yeah, but that, the, you, people come out of retirement, right? Yeah. Floyd Mayweather came out of retirement. All right, go ahead. But we're gonna get like we're, we gotta record, but okay, go ahead. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we gotta record, man. But you gotta give you gotta give the people what they want, right? All right. Well, they, 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 didn't what they, they didn't want. ask for me to rap. They, they asked for you to rap. <laughs> so if you want to give them what they want, then you need to spit a verse, not me. No one asked no, for that. I think they wanted me to get, to give you a beat that, and then have you rap. That's it. not what they said, but okay, go ahead. Yeah, they, people strongly implied that. All right, go ahead, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Drop some bars, son. Ready, go, cap. <laughs> Real quick, time we have to leave to be at that bus place. He said it's like eight minutes away. Yeah, it yeah. is eight minutes away. End of the bus stop in the ghetto. We want the rap. Ghetto. We want the dizzle. See, they want the dizzle. <laughs> Someone yeah. said, did you chase Anthony yeah. away? Wood we'll drop some bars. He Anthony wants you to rap, bro. Anthony gets scared in front of the camera. Rap about <laughs> Scooby-Doo. Rap about rape? Mm -hmm. What? That must be a Hebrew Israelite commenting. Rape. 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 You can't see, but just look into the. All right, go ahead. I showed my face. Go ahead, go ahead. Are you gonna bust me a, a beatbox? Yeah, be, go ahead, bro. Yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> they call me Santa because I slay. I'm chilling with John's last name McCray. McCray, he's not the Cray. He's J O N. Check it out now. X17 again in the mix on a YouTube. Coming to a theater, brand new, real soon, video number two, 200K, oh, Sunday, today's the day, the first live stream, check it out, the Avengers team, we on the scene, we ain't that mean, you gotta wash your hands so you stay in clean, it's not adulation, frustration, rock this entire nation, salvation from black to white, I spit this beat in the middle of the night, yes, y'all went to your neighborhood, I chill with a cracker named David Wood, but it's all good. He dropped the beat. Okay, let's record. Beep. Oh man, it's the first time you ever got me to drop a beat, man. <laughs> good job. Hey, someone asked, uh, who was that? David, any plans for 200,000? Yes, <laughs> yes, yep, yes. Just so you know, we got plans for 200k. You got to get like a survival kit, okay? <laughs> yeah. And you got to check all your computer software, make sure it's edited properly or everything's going to shut down. Oh, wait, 200K subscribers got it. I'm just pulling books off Anthony's shelf over here. But, hey, that's uh, not Anthony's shelf. That's my shelf. I mean, uh, vocab shelf. What is this? You're, you're, come on. You guys You guys look alike. Anyway. All Sicilians look alike? <laughs> all Sicilians look alike. So listen, uh, people ask me uh, about good apologetics books oh, good. on Islam. Uh Answering Islam. We need to plug this in, bro. Matter of fact, I'll give you a list right now. Uh, Answering Islam. It's by Norm Geisler and Abdul Salib. As far as uh, introductions to Islam, the first uh, third of the book, first third of the book is just a presentation of what Islam teaches. So uh, a Muslim would read that and say, this is an excellent presentation of what Islam teaches. And then the second third of the book is a critique of Islamic beliefs. And then a third, uh, the, the final third of the book is, um, is a defense of Christian claims. And so, uh, excellent book here. Uh, Nabil's books, uh, also good. Robert Spencer's book, The Truth About Muhammad, as far as a quick biography of Muhammad. That's an excellent book. And what else? What else would be good on Islam? I, I mean, really, for people who want to study Islam, um, uh, the, the, the best resource, I would say, is the, is the website, Answering Islam. It's like answering-islam.org. But I would recommend studying Islam topically, picking a topic you're interested in, go to Answering Islam and uh, and find the articles on that topic and learn the topic, master the topic, then move on to another topic rather than just taking the Quran and reading it straight through. It's a, it's a jumbled book and people who start like that, oh, I wanna learn about Islam, I'm gonna start with the Quran, those people usually give up because it's a very, very difficult reading. You study topically, then you go to all the Quran verses that are on that topic and so on, learn those, so um, anyway.
People are asking about the pulpit and pin video. Have you read this though? Oh yeah, that's coming out after two hundred thousand. The Quran dilemma by Al Fadi and his people. No, but Al Fadi's a Al Fadi's a Al Fadi's the man. So that's him and his people. This is a nice book. You definitely got to get the Quran dilemma. Look how beautifully it's laid out. It's very very beautiful. All right, so uh, how tall are you? Me? <laughs> yeah, how tall are you? No, I know. He's it's towering over his. I used to be six. Like I used to be six three, and now for some reason I don't know what happened, but I'm like six two and a half. I guess just getting older. It happens. Your yeah. ears and your nose gets bigger. Yeah, and you get slightly shorter. Man, why do you have all these? You got people from Lebanon. Mm -hmm. Looks like we're about to have a poker game. The Pope's a child molester. Uh, someone put that person in a timeout. We're not really trying to do that. Yeah, what the heck? Having virgin issues, then come to Europe, the land of Muslim rape. We're not really trying to do that either. Hobbits. What's your man? <laughs> he calling you you guys hobbits. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I am a hobbit because I love second breakfast. You're shrinking. <laughs> oh, my gosh. This is... <clears throat> Right. Ah, raccoon was signed out by George. Ha. See, raccoon see, was you need your moderators. They already know what to do. I, I picked the right people. You guys doubt my powers, bro, but you don't know what you're doing. You're, you're a new timer. You don't even know nothing about YouTube, bro. I don't care if you. <laughs> These are jokes, by the this way. This person said Renee would know. probably make a good moderator. That's true. Can oh, Renee okay. right there? Renee All right, right there. Renee, I got you. I got you. It's a little hard to catch oh. up. Hey. <laughs> Hold on, wait. You scroll you? up. You uh, scroll no, up. I know. Oh, it, just, I I say, say, it just hey. moves so fast, <laughs> bro. Renee asked, uh, Chicago yeah, style or New York style pizza? Hey, check this out. So I, I live uh -huh. in the Bronx, right? It never crosses anyone's mind to get pizza from 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 a place that's not like New York pizza. These guys ordered Pizza Hut because they're in Phoenix and they don't know any better. <laughs> And, and they order pizza and they're like, oh, uh, should we go to Little Caesars or or should it be Domino's? <laughs> this or, is totally or it be Pizza. Hut? This is totally not a true story. The way he's telling it is totally untrue. This this what he just gave is about as reliable as a Hadith chain. The way he just gave that was not a reliable recollection of what really happened. Just so everyone knows, I made Renee. Everyone, I made Renee Ahmad. You're, oh, look what you're Ahmad, Renee. What they ordered? Hot from the hut, and the hut here is Pizza Hut. Who's and they? They even put they even put a, a they got a they got a Valentine's Day heart shaped pizza. <laughs> oh my goodness! David is the cooler out. version of Malone. Oh, you get timed out for that, bro. You get timed out, Patrick. That's what people post nasty comments about me, and I just crack up, and then Boca's like, I'm, I'm the, blocking them. I'm no, blocking the, them. It's that's a joke timeout. That's like a joke timeout because oh, okay, they know I'm. They put a joke. I'm joking back. That they're obviously not really being. It's, it's a joke. But they really are in time. Okay, I was like, I'm reporting you to YouTube. <laughs> I'm flagging your channel. See, all of this, like, Muhammad is a pot of pe pedophile um, sodomite. Just, just chill, man. Just chill with all that. Abdo, our Abo Lolo says, hey, everybody, and David Wood, ex-Muslim here. Congratulations. All right. His great learning on his brain is weighing him down. No, I don't think that's what it is. Uh, but Okay, here's what it is with the pizza. First of all, there's only two parts Sicilians in the room, and it's me and Anthony. Anthony's the one who ordered the pizza. We're just trying to get quick pizza. It's not about all that. This guy's from West Virginia. What can we what learn about he, this? He didn't even know. From the what does he even know? You know more about pizza You're not than people from, from the Bronx. Sicily. I've been there long enough to be from, from the there. Bronx. I lived in the Bronx, Bronx longer than I lived in West Virginia, so what do you say that? Okay. Do Sicilians cut their pizza in squares or triangles? David, uh, are you going to they write don't. a book? They just take the whole thing and <laughs> square, square, <laughs> square. square. The answer is squares. Obviously, no. the answer, obviously, the answer is squares so because you, you wouldn't know. have asked it unless it was different. You don't know, bro. So but that's not true knowledge. Induction is not true knowledge. <laughs> uh, am I the other Sicilian guy? I was asking. Are you the Sicilian guy? <laughs> no, got, hey, we hey, can hey. look like that. Oh, for a few guys who were talking about uh, Gino's in, in in Chicago and stuff like that. Um, Sicilian cuisine no, is the best Italian no, cuisine. I, look, I, I already no, made that person a moderator. Had, Good call. I've had Chicago style people, pizza, New York style pizza. New York style pizza blows Chicago style pizza well, agree out of the water. Out of the water, it's not even it's not even close. Unless you just grew up with Chicago style pizza and you're used to it and you you wouldn't know anything. Can you give a cop the shout out? Who? Shout out to the cops. To the cops? The cops. Oh, the know, cops. Egyptians. Okay, yeah, I was yeah, like, to the cops. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to give no no to the cops, but to the cops, I will, yeah. Cop to Christians. Yeah, cop to Christians. Shout out to the cop to Christians. Info on the Shabir debate. That is uh, yeah. March 3rd, George Mason University. It's going to be sweet. 
It's going to be good. Uh, I, I mean, Shabir is is the best in the world as far as Muslim debaters on uh Thank you, Lita. So. Holding it down, Lita. So Lita knows us. Thank you, Lita, holding it down. <laughs> David, are you going to write any more books? We actually just talked about that. Yeah, you can watch his his, uh, his stuff. Yeah, that we just did it in an interview. Do I see a mafia movie in the works? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My yeah. friend is a West Virginia politician, yeah. and only 16. David Wood's going to be the odd father. <laughs> it's like the dumbest thing I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> the odd father. And I'm going to be the Debate situation. Zachary Knight. The, Why would Debate people Zachary say For the record, ladies and gentlemen, I have no actual desire to debate Zucker Knight apart from his followers thinking that he's actually willing See, to debate. Right? Person, time him out. Let me what? time. Sorry, go ahead. Go ahead. Answer the question. Yeah, people are pointing it out. Zucker Knight won't debate, right? All of the top Christian debaters have been challenging Zachary Knight for years. He turns him down, right? This, now, it's a brilliant move that he pulled, right? He debated um, a couple of people who just weren't debaters. He, he debated uh, some local pastor or something like that years ago. He debated William Campbell. William Campbell Sharp, he has, a, he has an excellent book, but uh, awesome. he, he had no debate experience. And so Zachary Knight um, debated like two or three people years ago that – no one would ever put forward as a debater, and he debated them. And all the while, Christian debate, actual Christian debaters who focus on debating, been challenging him for years, mm -hmm. won't go anywhere near him. Now, think about how brilliant this is, right? I could get some imam who had no debate experience in his life, get him to get him to debate, and then find some other Muslim who's never debated, never had any debate experience, and get him to debate, and then claim that I've taken down Islam's top debaters without ever facing Islam's top debaters. People could do that. But I mean, that's kind of pathetic. That is like the most pathetic thing. Yeah, that is like when, yeah, vocab said went like when, when Ahmed D. Dot debated, uh, debated Jimmy Swagger. Now, the reason people like D. Dot and Nike will do that is if you're a Muslim, right? If you're a Muslim living in India or something like that, you don't know the difference between uh, Jimmy Swagger and William Lane Craig, right? You don't know the difference. You don't follow, you know, Christian speakers, Christian debaters, and so on. So you don't know that one of them is actually an experienced debater and the other is, you know, just a guy who runs a church. So you don't know the difference. So you see D Dot or Zucker Knight debate someone and you, oh my goodness, look what he did to them. And these he's only picking, they're only picking people who aren't debaters. Um, and so Zucker Knight has made his career out of out of running, right? And now, now by, that's fine, he can do that, but when Muslims come to us and say, oh, you wouldn't say this to Zakir Naik because he would destroy you. I mean, that, that kind of shows that Zakir Naik understands his target audience. His target audience is clueless people. And they're people that he can trick, they're gullible people, that he can trick into thinking he's a champion debater when he's not. And that, I mean, you know, if he can get away with it because of the community he's targeting, then he can get away with it. But let's not pretend that this is a guy who's actually willing to debate. He's not. The guy's a, the guy's a joke. Hey. <laughs> Dr. White Meat. That's <laughs> yeah. For, hey, for those of you who are interested, go watch, uh, go watch Nabil's video, um, Zucker Nike, 25 errors in five minutes, oh, where yeah. Nabil just went through five minutes, right? Someone asked Zucker Nike a question. That's the other thing about how gullible his followers are. They don't go back and look up what he says, right? They listen to him speak and they don't know what, they don't know what they're talking about. They don't know what he's talking about. They don't know anything about the topic. So as long as he keeps running his mouth, people think, oh, he knows so much when he's spouting total nonsense. And Nabil, um, who, ha who has a, a medical doctorate, um, listened to five minutes of a of a science presentation by Nike, and Nike made twenty five mistakes, and that's how he speaks all the time. But if if guess what? If he has a thousand people in the audience, and only five people in the audience know that what he's saying is utter nonsense, then guess what? All the other people just became Zucker Nike fans, and they think, wow, he really knows what he's talking about. And only five people are going, this guy has no clue what he's talking about. He's just spouting nonsense. But um, that's where you guys come in. We come in. Um, we gotta, we gotta tell people, right? We gotta. There's, there's no, there's no simple way of doing it. It's just a lot of work. You have to go through his claims and and refute them. And uh, the easy way to do that would be on stage, right? Get him on stage, refute him on stage. Since he's not willing to do that, then it's a longer route. It's a longer route, but I'm still gonna do it. Cool. Let's see. 
Yeah. Where's everybody out again? Where do you guys, uh, where's everybody live? Hang on, do it, do it, do it, do a quick test because uh, I want to know how this works. Um, I don't know what the audio is like. Is the audio clear if we're talking from this, from this far away? It's for future reference, a scientific experiment. I could have thought my snowball would be better, but. How long of a delay is there? Okay, so they yeah. say yes. Uh, tell me back okay. here. Like if I'm talking back here at the normal rate, uh, what uh, what's the sound like back here if I'm talking like back here? So I can always uh, hook up mics in the future. <clears throat> All right, we're gonna record a little uh, a little promo <clears throat> conference promo. <clears throat> Where's that, a light? Where'd that flyer go? I don't know. What'd you do with it? Oh, here it is. We're in Vocab's living room and uh, turning it into a little uh, studio. You know, if I want to record more, I wonder if I should just leave this part of the couch like kind of like. <coughs> oh, off? Yeah. You know what I mean? Because like. Well, if it's just you, then you don't you don't actually need to. You can have a camera right there, and as long as you get a chair over there or something like that. If you're standing up, you don't need it. I don't. I don't really need this. <clears throat> you know, like, hmm? I don't really need that extra room. Oh wait, we got a mic up. Yeah, we do. John, you missed it. Oh, they said he wants to hear David bust the rhyme. You can comment back to people, by the way. Yeah, no, I don't need to. I can talk. I know. But I'm yeah. just saying, like, say we're recording and you want to talk. You know, yeah, you yeah. Can, all kinds of things like that. Yeah, just so you know. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, the everyone, are coming in so fast. If you want to look, that's why I put on slow mode. Like this is yep. the slow mode. Is it, yeah, imagine slow without slow, slow yeah. mode, yeah, it'd yeah. be horrible. Can you read it? Yeah. That means only every sixty seconds they can do. <laughs> it says we can hear Anthony breathing in the other room. <laughs> <laughs> hey, make that person a moderator. <laughs> hey, just for that, uh, Angie, you deserve to become a moderator. <laughs> <laughs> hey, by the way, if you guys do want to look at other stuff with the Hebrews lights, there's one of the moderators on here whose channel you should follow, K Dub True. K Dub, say something so they can see you, so they can just click on you, right? There you got it. You got it, Angie. Yeah, all right. Let's do this thing. Hey, why does everyone pick like hip hop names if they're involved with like black Hebrews or lights? They don't. Are you talking? No, I'm talking to you. I'm talking, they don't. I'm talking like all they the. Pick, the fake, he, Oh, no, him? yeah, yeah. Because yeah. we're all former rappers. That's why we're Oh, him. okay. He's he raps. How too. come you guys never like he go has... your entire lives as rappers? Well, after you're done rapping, you become an apologist. That's a, oh yeah, that's, that's a... the retirement plan. <laughs> that's, that's the way it works. But he's still active, actually. He just dropped a video called Pseudo Israelites. Oh yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> Malone looks like he's trying to copy David's look. I'm what? trying to copy David's look. <laughs> I'm <am> not. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know, hey, you know what? You know what he told me. This is a true story. If he wants to, he can stop me. He says when he walks down the street in the Bronx, the black barbers stop him and say, "Hey, hey, bro, those white barbers are jacking up your hair," and they give him a card no, they because they, they, they recognize they go down, the like, travesty. Like the Bronx, they have, you know, this. they have the uh, barber shops where everyone hangs out and stuff like this. And I go to like, I go to like Russians and stuff like this. Russians are too Armenians, quick. They're Armenians too quick. Like that. Yeah, they cut my hair in five minutes, which mine. Well, that's my concern. I'm gonna get in there and get out and stuff. But, but I'm wa I walk down the street and. Uh, guys come out from from other barber shops. They come out and they're like, "Those white barbers are messing up your hair, dude. <laughs> come by any time. I'll fix you up. I'll fix you up." Yeah. And then, but the vocab tells me, "No, nah, they'll spend like an hour cutting your hair." Yeah. And and tell you joke and give you a sucker. <laughs> <laughs> you don't go. I'm not. I'm not dissing Russians or any Eastern Europeans. All I'm saying, if a person is stop being so Russophobic. If, if a person has been <laughs> to a black barber, they don't go back. You know, you're making it too easy. Man. I'm, I know. You know, that's all I'm saying. Get on there so I can see uh, where you're standing. At. David, were you born this awesome, or did you have to work for it? 
Uh, a little bit of both. He was born about. totally different. A little bit of nature, a little bit of nurture. Of nature and nurture, yeah. Why? <laughs> Don't, man, this is why we, you need us to make fun of you. Because when people say something like that, Howdy from know, Texas, howdy. This is a problem. I can't get this high enough without, uh, without filming upwards. Wow. So Anybody out there uh, live in Colorado? Down? Should we be sitting down then as a response to that? Yeah, we can just be sitting there. You just want to sit here? Move it. Want to sit over here? I don't know. Books are always. We nice. need to get. We need to be moving fast. It's almost six. Well, let's just. We get, uh, let's just sit here then. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's, it's fine for fun. you, but I, I'm looking at you. You're at the top, so if I record me as well, then can you just bend down like a little bit? No, just grab two chairs. All grab right. another chair. Yo, Wood. What's your favorite movie? Man, what's up, Eli? I see you. Uh, my favorite, favorite movie. What's up, Andy? Um, Mad Max. Fury Road. Um, oh now I know a lot, lots of people thinking uh, you know there are other movies better than that. I've always liked movies where you could you know tell an awesome story without saying a lot. And there are, there are very few lines in the entire movie. It's basically one long car chase. So to actually pull that off as this, and and I like like epic displays, not like you know not not having everything CGI nowadays. Just uh, if you could pull off a movie where it's basically one big car chase through the desert, that's uh, that was awesome. So anyway, I like that one. I like some other movies, but. Taylor said you make me look short. It's because you're so tall. Yeah. He makes all of us look short. Favorite TV show? <clears throat> Favorite TV show yep. of all time? Dukes of Hazard. Breaking Bad. Come on, yeah. dude. Let's do this, bro. <clears throat> John, can you uh, yeah. do anything? We'll get you mic'd up. Yep. How we look. I can see how we look. Oh, okay. You man the battle station, John. All right, word. Uh, lighting looks fine. We can always flip this. This don't even need to be perfect, bro. This I is can always like... flip this back so we can see it. See? <laughs> so I did that. Yeah, this is a quick. <clears throat> you do need to get mic'd up there. Where's our mics? Look at the mics. You just sit there. Okay, I'll take care of everything. <clears throat> Where are the mics? Hmm? Where are the mics? I don't know. Anthony took them and there we go. Anybody know where the mics are? The what? The mics. Oh. Uh, uh, I found them. Never mind. Yep. David Wood saves the day once again. Oh my gosh, dude. We're using 48. a uh, Sony one UTX BO3 lapel mics. One knee mine says, uh, Oh, oh that's what you guys set up for. Hey, you, you all should go uh, follow uh, his, Make his YouTube moderate. channel. One of mine. Yeah, we interviewed him back uh, back on uh, the Trinity channel. Oh. He's got his testimony on there. So, Oh, okay. oh we're setting up for, well, we uh, mentioned this earlier, but we're setting up because Anthony's going to record some videos on the uh, Trinity in the Old Testament. Um, but uh, right now we're going to record a little a little announcement, and we figured we could uh, we can also practice YouTube live since we're doing it. We kind of didn't have a chance to do it separately, so we're doing it while we're uh, setting up and stuff. Yeah. Because we're taking off to the, we're taking off tonight, so we're kind of trying to get as many things done as we could, and we've been wanting to wanting to test this out for for some future plans. What do you mean? What's your favorite meme? My favorite meme? What, what, oh, I know my favorite You're the meme. meme. Yeah, I know your, your favorite, favorite meme, meme too. Like yeah, the, my favorite meme is the meme that has me saying, "What do you meme?" So that way you can meme the meme. You get it? You don't get it. You can watch my video I don't, on it. I don't understand. What do you mean? Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> what it what what did it, do you remember what my video was called on that? What do you mean? It's like what to post in response. To oh yeah yeah yeah. Um, what it's something like what to do when you see dumb memes. In my video, something like that. Like this. Um, love our enemies. Jesus Christ told us yes. Mm. We do love our enemies. They have good radio voices. I don't think I do. Vocab and David would have good radio voices. Anthony Rogers has a great radio face. <laughs> <laughs> it's because you're not in here, bro. Where is Anthony? Anthony, where are you? Where is Anthony? He's in the other room, but he's oh. being all reclusive. He's in there hiding. Reclusive. Uh -huh. I'm to Anthony, you want to come talk about something? Check, check, check. Does anybody have any questions right, for so Anthony Rogers? Look, check, check. So as we look at the evidence, and when we see the evidence coming in, uh, no, no, what am I memeing about? I'm hey, memeing about check, some check, memes. Check, check. Seventh annual. 
Muslim Evangelism Conference. You want to come. Fantastic. All right, speaker. the real Alexa Pena. See ya. Minister from Cali. Mm -hmm. Jeff check, Tran, check, check, check. Jewish brother. Going to talk about the Trinity Old Testament. I'll find former Muslim. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, subscribe. Thank you. Testimonials from others. All right, running. George Saeed from Ministry of Muslims. Back. I'm going to put it back. All right, I'm going to stop him first. What do you want me to say? No, you don't have to stop it. Oh, okay. Keep rolling. I'll okay. drop the info real quick. <laughs> no, I mean. You can even tell. Are you going to do where you're? Are you mic'd up? Yeah, mic'd up. Mic'd up right here. If I'm mic'd up right there. Right there. Yeah, yeah. I'm looking. I set it up. You see the, you see the things moving? Yeah. You just co sign it, maybe you could, you know, the idea. I'll, I'll, I'll give this Anthony to you. Rogers, you want to take some questions or are you busy? Are you going to hold it up? Yeah. All right. Are you ready? Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, ready? You guys ready? 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 Focus. All right. I'm going to have to shut up for a minute while they record. Yeah, you just type. Type and, type and be adorable. <laughs> 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 yeah, actually, yeah, I will type. <laughs> David would come to Arizona again, please. I'm coming to Arizona every month. Yeah. And then our, you're talking up until, here. Until, too, right? until summer. Until summer. Yeah. Coming to Arizona every month until summer. Whenever. Wood will be in Arizona every month, as will I. Until summer. Until summer. Nobody wants to be in Arizona until <clears throat> summer. No. We will be going to New York <laughs> or Colorado or somewhere. There we go. Yeah, already recording. So it's um, Mask and Fools. Yep. All right, three, Go ahead. You can use my videos. Two, yep. one. What's up? Vocab Malone here with my good friend David Wood from Act 17 Apologetics. I want to tell you about a dynamic, incredible apologetics and evangelism conference coming up here in the Phoenix, Arizona area. We're going to have fantastic speakers. Real quick, let me see that, bro. I'm looking here, and I already see Al Fadi. I already see four of Muslim going to give his testimony. See, and my buddy Irwin here and his wife. Great What's testimony. Wife? They're going to give an awesome testimony and share some honest struggles about the journey from Islam to Christianity. See, my uh, one of the coolest Christians on the planet, Pastor George Saeed. He's going to be coming from California. He does runs, ministry to Muslims. Ministry to Muslims came from the Sudan, where you get in a lot of trouble if you're a Christian and you criticize Islam. You come to the United States, and all of a sudden, he finds out that he's allowed to preach to any Muslim, that he's allowed to question Islam, challenge Islam publicly, and he is taking advantages of all our freedoms here in the United States. And then George and Ash are going to teach us how to witness the Muslims even at the mosque, meaning you talk to them as they're coming out. Also, we got Brother Jafar coming all the way from California, a fantastic Jordanian Christian who's written some great books under the name of Little Jacob. And also my brother Jeff Cran, who's actually a Messianic Jewish Christian, and he's going to talk about the foundations of the Trinity in the Old Testament. This is the speaker lineup as well as the surprises, so you definitely want to come to this conference. And just so everyone knows, there is no better time in all of history to reach Muslims with the gospel. No better time. For 14 centuries, you had... Christians over here, and you have Muslims over there. Very little overlap. Uh, it's only in our time where you have massive amounts of overlap, and not only do you have that, you have access to the internet where you can reach Muslims around the world. So uh, it, this is brand new. This It's only in our time where every time you walk out your door, every time you walk down the street, uh, you encounter Muslims, and Muslims who for 14 centuries, 14 centuries worth of Muslims in certain areas could not have heard criticisms of Islam, could not have heard alternatives to Islam, all of a sudden anyone with an internet connection has access to hearing all of these things that they wouldn't have before. We are in a generation that has opportunities that previous generations couldn't even have dreamed of. Mm -hmm. Don't want to miss this, so it's time to get trained and this is a good place Come to, go. to this conference, it's going to be the best speakers on the best topics. You don't want to miss it. February 23rd and 24th. That's February 23rd to Friday. February 24th, Saturday, at Hillside Baptist Church and First Arabic Baptist Church. I'm going to put the address and the information about how to find out more information about the conference in the description box as well at the end of this video so you can see it. As if you want to come and volunteer, we need some more volunteers, get us up about that. It's free of charge. We will take donations each day, you know what I'm saying, to make it go, but it's free of charge. So there's no excuse why you should not come. This is dynamic. You do not want to miss it. February 23rd. 24. Be there if you're anywhere near Phoenix or can get there. <clears throat> People still paying yeah. attention to you over here? Yeah. All right. I think All right. That, that was good. Just turn that off and give that to me. Oh, look, can you do the Patreon one? I don't really know how to do that one much. 
The idea is you're like, hey, support my brother on Patreon, right? No, we're doing front of everyone. So I should leave? Huh? Should I? No, no, no. We're in front of the camera. No, we're live. Okay. You, know what I'm saying? you haven't put it out yet. You know what I'm saying? All right. Okay. Well, then let's do that another time. No, no, no. We can do it in the end when we're set, we're set up over here. For, and we're okay. just standing. We're so that means that it's time for Anthony right now? <clears throat> Any chance you're going to Ohio? See, Ohio. all these people want you to go to Ohio. Ohio. What's in Ohio? Yeah, that, that's I'm moving to about. Ohio. Yeah, yeah, I'll go to Ohio if I go deer hunting. <laughs> you don't know nothing about Ohio. You don't know nothing about Ohio, bro. I'm from Columbus, everybody. Hey, warrior for God. I'm a Calvinist. Praise you. I mean, praise Jesus. We're <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm posting <laughs> just that clip. And then I'm cutting out the part where he corrects himself. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Yo, but what I'm saying is I'm from Ohio, from Columbus, originally living in Phoenix right now, but I'm probably going to be moving back. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even know what's going on with these folks. They got some crazy. <clears throat> That's a lamp. It's not a wine glass. This a guy says you can hunt off. on his property. Oh, my gosh. People are getting. Scotland loves you. Tazariak oh, here. <laughs> That's not Tazariak. <laughs> Yo, I can't. This is on slow mo. This is yeah, unbelievable. No, it's really quick. It's hard to keep up. You got to put on slow mo whenever you go live, bro. Yeah. This is called Gaffer's Tape. Gaffer's Tape? <laughs> you take, you take <laughs> the, the mouth shut. You take, you take, you take the, the Gaffer's mouth. Hold on, hold on. Oh, no. I got to do a demonstration. You have to demonstrate <laughs> how you use the Gaffer Tape. <laughs> oh, boy. So this is Gaffer's Tape, everybody. Shut up, Gaffer. <laughs> so, uh, Anyway, gaffer's tape, ladies and gentlemen. It's uh it's basically tape you use while uh while setting up tech equipment because um it doesn't it doesn't leave sticky residue on anything. So you can tape your mics, you can tape your cameras and stuff like that. It doesn't leave any residue. So or your gaffers. Check that out. <laughs> Apparently Christians are sensitive. Wasn't even insulting you Nazis. Someone get rid of that person. A moderator, get rid of that person that just said that. <laughs> it's not about sensitive. It's about having constructive comments. Wasn't even insulting you Nazis. <laughs> Just, please, someone get rid of that person. I had no desire whatsoever to insult you Hitler worshipping Nazis <laughs> from hell. Columbus, Ohio. See, people know what's up south side in the house. You horrible spawns of Satan. I wasn't even insulting you. <laughs> and you muted me for 10 minutes. <laughs> oh, my goodness. This is insane. All right, well, we need to record. Anthony. We do need to record. All right, everyone, we're gonna have to uh, yeah, sign off. But uh, we'll keep doing this. We're uh, we'll be maybe we'll announce we'll announce it ahead of time beforehand if anyone wants to uh, <clears throat> discuss things. But um, yeah, so we're meeting about once a month to record some videos. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Sorry. We're trying to sign off without reading all these comments. Um, all right, so we're going to have to sign off because uh, we're all heading out here in two hours, and so yeah. we have to get all the remaining videos done. But we will do this again next month and yeah, in the person. following month. So uh, see you all then. I don't know how to turn this off. So. Oh, let me show you. So Bye, got... everybody. Good talking with you. Bye. Peace. All right, so. <laughs> Thank you, yeah. You just close everything? Uh, yeah. No, no. Oh, you need to go back the windows, man. to the hangout part of it. Oh, right here. Right here. Wait, that's not right. You just close the window. No, that's not it. This Because this is this is not even like. Bless you too. This isn't the broadcast. Yeah. Ah, that's not the broadcast either. No. The broadcast is the one that shows our face. You know what I'm talking about? Nope. Uh, I don't oh, I think they, it's soft. No, no. No, it's still alive. <laughs> I don't think this is going to do it if I do this. Where's the daggone thing? Yeah, I'll, I'll figure it out, brother. It's the part that's like says, there it is, there it is. Peace oh, out, people. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it took like an hour and a half.